Hello everyone, welcome and thank you so much for tuning in today. My name is Sophia Sokolai and I'm thrilled to be joining Concerts for Compassion as Head of Public Relations. Concerts for Compassion has done such incredible work for communities around the world and I'm honored to be a part of their mission of facilitating cultural integration by bringing music and education to displaced peoples and their local communities. Working with organizations such as the United Refugee Agency, the Red Cross, and Support International, Concerts for Compassion has visited over 30 countries in North America, Central America, Europe, and the Middle East. Our work is threefold, performing concerts at refugee camps, teaching educational programs for children in refugee camps and their local communities, and giving benefit concerts for organizations that support refugees globally. But before we share any more about Concerts for Compassion's work and current projects, I'd like to introduce the music and performers of our first piece for you today. Founders and violinists Jocelyn Zhu and Mariella Hobbs will perform the minuetto and trio from Louis Spohr's duet number no. two for two violins.
I'm Austin Berman, the new Executive Director of Concerts for Compassion, and I'm excited to share some highlights from CFC's recent work. Over the last four years, CFC has visited 10 countries across North and Central America, Europe, and the Middle East, with the mission of facilitating cross-cultural integration among post-migration refugees and their local communities through music, education, and dialogue. We've had the privilege of partnering with the Red Cross and UN Refugee Agency and having our work featured through National Sawdust on Good Morning America and WQXR. Through one of our recent 2018 workshops in Tegucigalpa, Jocelyn met inspiring Honduran violinists, Carlos and Ileana, who you'll hear next. Both Carlos and Ileana are founding members of the Tegucigalpa Symphony Orchestra and the Honduran Symphony Association, among other accomplishments you can read from their bios. They generously recorded two pieces for our concert today, Alfonsina and the Sea, and With You, works composed by Ariel Ramirez and Claudio Estrada, respectively, both arranged by Carlos himself. Please enjoy.
I'm so excited to be sharing our upcoming adventures in 2022 with you. We are finally returning to international travel and our first chapter will be in Latin America. Our program for 2022 will include three components. The first of which is a 15 video series that encompasses a few items such as music therapy, violin technique, and guided listening. To complement our 15 video series, we are also offering six to 10 young refugee youths in Latin America a scholarship in order to study virtually with some of our teachers here in New York. All of this will culminate in an integration concert at the end of the year of 2022. Thank you for joining us today and please enjoy this next piece by Milad Yusufi called Rescue Me, originally written for the Vision Trio who has very generously donated this recording to our benefit concert today.
In order to make Puente a la Harmonia a reality for 2022, we have to raise a total of $20,000. These costs will enable us to provide the video series, to provide instruments for the students, and to provide the scholarship students with lessons, along with the integrative event at the end of the year. The last time we went on a mission to Central America, one of the boys in the audience begged the musicians to play the instruments they were playing. And after he got to play a few minutes on the violin, he, along with all the other kids, was asking when we were coming back to make more music. We would love to keep this promise to the kids and any amount that you can give to help us do this would be so appreciated. There is no amount that is too small. Every amount will help us reach those $20,000. There are many ways to give. You can donate through PayPal, you can donate through Zelle, or you can send cash or a check in the mail at our mailing address. All the details for how to donate are in the description box below. You can follow the links to send the donation however you prefer to send your donation. Thank you so much. Thank you for being here and see you next time.